Heroes are not born, they're made. Occasionally, they're thrust into that role suddenly. Often they grow into it slowly, sometimes taking many years to show their inner ethos that was there all along. That was the case with Helena Thurber. Born in the Washington Heights section of New York City, Helena attended George Washington High School, which is where her formal education ended. Her parents passed away when she was young, so Helena had to support herself, taking on a variety of jobs from Wall Street to bookkeeping at small companies. As she says, if I wasn't learning at a job, I moved on. She was managing the office for a small truck manufacturer when John Thurer bought the company and made Helena an offer she couldn't refuse to come work for him. It took a few years, but eventually John made another offer Helena couldn't refuse. He proposed. Together, they grew the company John's grandfather had founded as builder of horse-drawn wagons in 1888 into the second largest manufacturer of truck trailers and shipping containers in the U.S. But with John's health failing, the couple sold the company and retired to the Florida Keys, all the while acquiring extensive real estate holdings there and back in New Jersey. When John passed in 1994, Helena, the self-taught accountant and real estate magnate, continued to astutely manage her holdings through economic downturns and recessions, then slowly selling them off. Until today, the only real estate she owns is her home. Helena knew she had been blessed with a loving, if too short, marriage and the wherewithal to share her good fortune. So Helena embarked on a voyage of philanthropy with a gift to the medical center that was founded the same year as her late husband's truck company. Her first gift was dedicated to the memory of her late husband. It helped establish the John Thurer Cancer Center at Hackensack University Medical Center. Realizing the benefit her gift has had for the thousands of cancer patients treated there, Helena then decided to go all in on philanthropy with an additional $25 million gift to help build a modern pavilion that would help bring together exceptional patient care and medical innovation. This powerful combination would extend her impact on healthcare and research beyond cancer, pushing medicine beyond traditional thinking and providing patients with amazing possibilities. That building and its legacy will bear her name at Hackensack Meridian Medical Center. But Helena's impact goes still further. Her belief in giving back and paying forward will encourage others to share their good fortune. As she likes to say, I don't need all the money I have to live. I should share it. And I hope it inspires those with, quote, a little extra cash here and there, that it's okay to give it away, you know, for a good cause, end quote. And so we award Helena Thurr with the Pontifical Hero Award for Inspiration as a recognition of her generous philanthropy and unwavering dedication to improving the lives of patients and winning our collective fight against cancer.